Hello and welcome all my dear second standard little champs. How have you been? This is Rohan sir from Mahdi English Medium School welcoming all my dear second standard girls and boys once again in the English lecture. Students I hope that you have been following all the lectures in the sequence it is being uploaded for you people and I hope that boys and girls are working very hard are really doing a good revision work through these lectures sent it to you. Students I also am pretty sure that you might be following the homework, the notes from the lectures. Now within few days you will be getting the homework regularly in the different ways in your WhatsApp group. Yes, what is that way? You will get to know it is a kind of surprise for you people. Just please make sure that you keep watching the lectures for that surprise. So my dear students welcome once again in the English lecture as you know that we are revising few topics with the objectives so that the explanation will be very much useful. Once if you understand the poem understand the lesson then you don't have to mug up the answers specially for the objectives at least. Just if you understand and keep the concept in your mind and that's it you you will have to just revise the topic once before the exam. So this makes your work very very easier. Just the 30 minutes of lecture daily and that's it. So it is said right an apple in the day keeps the doctor away. Similarly, I have made the phrase for you people that the lecture in a day keeps the tension away. Yes, it really keeps the tension away if daily you watch the lecture once. My dear students, what are we going to do? You must be thinking that daily sir brings something interesting explanation. Today also I have brought some interesting explanation part. Cats sleep anywhere. Yes. We are going to recite and revise poem number 8. So I hope you all people are ready to revise this. First of all before starting the explanation we that means you and me are going to recite this line by line. As you know that in the revision always in the class we used to speak loudly enjoy with the actions. Yes, actions. Now I cannot do here. Even if I am doing here, you cannot see. But you can do actions at your home in front of the screen and repeat the poem lines with me. As even if you remember the poem line, it is going to be very much useful to you. It is going to be fruitful. So let's get started. First of all, those at least those students who are having the textbook. I want them to sit with their textbook poem 8 opened. I hope you are getting ready. Please make sure that you follow each and every instruction as to enjoy the lesson. If you will follow the instructions you will really really enjoy the lesson, the lecture, the poem. So now let's get started. I am going to display the textbook on the screen. My dear little champs, this is poem 8, Cats Sleep Anywhere. This is on the world of pet and I know that for the first time when I sent you this poem, you were very very ecstatic, you were very much happy reading this poem lines, reciting the poem with me and especially the cat lovers. They liked this poem really very much. They enjoyed this. Actually, they were able to connect themselves. So this is the main key. When you want to really enjoy something, you need to connect it with you, right? So this happens, this connectivity, when you keep that, everything is easy for you. Everything seems to be very easy for you. So let's get started with poem 8, Cats Sleep Anywhere. Now. I don't have to explain you anything about this. I have to just discuss it with you. See, I am using the word discussion, not explanation. Why? Because you know what cat does. You might be observing, especially in this big break from the school. Since this almost one year, you might have observed cats and dogs and everyone, especially the cats. Because 
they just roam around the houses we even can feed them milk chapati or many different things we can even keep them as the pet so you might be observing many of you yes might also be having cats at your place so let's start reciting this and then i'll start with the discussion so one by one line by line you have to recite this with me are you ready girls and boys i'll give you a couple of seconds take out this page if you have the textbook if you do not have be tension free just sit fold your hands eyes ears and brain here in the lecture i'll wait for the couple of seconds for those who are having the textbook for them to take out the page please make sure that you recite it that means you have to repeat the lines after me loudly and clearly so let's get started cats sleep anywhere any table any chair top of piano window ledge in the middle on the edge open drawer empty shoe anybody's lap will do fitted in a cardboard box in a cupboard with your frocks anywhere they don't care cats sleep anywhere wasn't it a lot of fun reciting this let us recite it one more time yes the poem lines are of basic important because unless you don't remember that you will not be able to answer the questions the objective questions let us recite it one more time it only took more no more than 2 minutes so let us repeat it i hope boys and girls again you are ready to repeat it with me let's recite cats sleep anywhere boys and girls loudly any table any chair top of piano window ledge in the middle on the edge open drawer empty shoe anybody's lap will do fitted in a cardboard box in a cupboard with your frocks anywhere they don't care cats sleep anywhere eleanor forgian is the name of the poet of this poem i should say beautiful poem made i think the poet might have made this poem based on the observation obviously every single line written here we can easily connect it from the observation we might have made looking at the cat there are several pictures given all around this poem we will now discuss it in the first two lines cats sleep anywhere any table any chair so here throughout the poem different places are mentioned where do the cats sleep how they are we come to know actually we consider the cats as notorious animal dogs are less comparatively but they are too depends on the breed correct but the cats are very notorious and are also cute at the same time we feel that so cats sleep anywhere they don't need specific place wherever they want they can fit at any place they can sleep here they have written in the first second line any table any chair yes we might have seen cats sleeping on the table on the chair of the houses if you have the pet cat at your place you might have seen they sleep even on the table on the dining table on the study table wherever they like and even on the chair empty chair if you keep it empty if you have the cat at your place or if you allow the 
cats at your house they you might have seen them cheating sitting on the chair as well top of piano window ledge in the middle on the edge now can you see this picture top of the piano this is the keyboard this is the piano an instrument musical instrument we can say used to play the music in orchestra or anywhere yes many of you might have even seen this type of musical instrument in the cartoon of tom and jerry right so this type of instrument when if when, if you keep cats can even sleep on that they just need the support they they can ma make anything they can convert anything in the way of their bed on the edge on the edge means what this might be the new word for you yes children top of the piano window ledge so what is the meaning of ledge and edge so window ledge first of all let me explain it to you here you can see window ledge is shown so this is the area when you open or close the window there this is the area we where we can say this is the ledge window ledge so this is a kind of shelf near the window where you can keep the things so a small or big place is there everywhere near the window almost everywhere so that is the shelf okay so that is the window ledge so they can even sleep in this small space they don't need much bigger space to sleep so top of the piano again top of the piano you see there is no much space here a very less space is there especially on the top of the piano even they sleep there they can sleep now you know that in the window ledge in the middle on the edge so they don't fear from sleeping on the edge edge means when particular land or particular things end point is there that is called edge okay now here say for an example cat is not sleeping on the middle part of the piano it's sitting on the ledge see it is about to end the part the this portions end part is here and just this is the cat where she is sleeping so they don't need specifically the middle portion to sleep they can even sleep at a small part or at, at the edge now especially when the small babies sleep on the bed uh, the parents make them or make sure that the babies are sleeping at the middle part of the bed and they just put the pillows around the babies so that they don't fall fall down now cats don't fear of falling down they can jump from many floors height so they can sleep on the edge part of anywhere open drawer empty shoe can you see here cat peeping inside the shoe so she sees that whether there is in, there's something there inside so they can sleep inside the empty shoe certainly if the if it is a kitten big cats cannot get inside the shoes no matter how big the shoes are they can keep their legs inside it but kittens can sleep inside this kind of shoe see how cute they are unlike dogs they don't tear the shoes so it is safe for us so open drawer open drawer means drawer means you can see that the small type of place under the makeup table dressing table or under the study table there is a kind of small box or small you know drawer which you can pull out and again put it inside it is a kind of sliding door it has that's called drawer where you can keep your things inside the cupboard so even if you keep the drawer open in that small space cats can sleep very easily anybody's lap will do fitted in the cardboard box oh anybody's lap can you see here cat is sleeping on the grandma's lap see she is so cute she is listening to the story grandma might be narrating and she is sleeping so 
they are not very much vicious or they are not very much cunning they are very cute and well to do with anything so you can see cat is sleeping on the lap yes i have the personal experience my at my place i have a cat who comes daily we feed them milk and the cats two or three cats are there it sits on the lap and we need to pet her that means we need to slowly you know like a small kid we need to rub our hands on the head so that they can sleep fitted in the cardboard box now cats can even sleep in the small cardboard box now when do you get the get the cardboard box when you buy new things like television freeze or different things when you buy new things you get the cardboard box right and sometimes it happens it is my personal experience boys and girls don't laugh at me it happened like i used to keep my shoes and my slippers in one small cardboard box which we got which was extra when we bought the new television it was an extra box so i used to put my shoes and my slippers inside the cardboard box so it so happened that the cardboard box obviously we cannot lock it it is not a door it does not has a door so what happened in that box cat slept it creeped inside when i was in the school and again when i went back home i was about to take the slippers i was almost very drowsy so i did not see inside what is inside because i was very sure obviously my slippers are there nothing else would be i never knew cat was already sleeping inside instead of picking up the slippers i picked up the cat and cat and i both were scared and both screamed loudly oh what did i hold it's really very funny like you never would have thought about this right i know that you also might be having many different incidents with the cats so in the card in the cardboard box it can fit very easily next line says in a cupboard with your frogs anywhere they don't care so yes cats can even sleep in the cupboard like this with your frogs if you are a boy cats can sleep with your shorts and t-shirts you never know don't keep your cupboard open otherwise it will happen like me like your sir got fooled when i was about to take my slippers i hold the cat you never know when you open the cupboard to take out your clothes cat might be there inside so it is very dangerous right you will really get startled suddenly if you see the cat unexpectedly right so it can even sleep there very easily see on the clothes which are folded on the towels cat is sleeping so easily and it always sleeps and sleeps anywhere they don't care cat sleep anywhere so they don't think about us that how would they feel they want to sleep if they want they can sleep anywhere it is said that even if you keep the milk bowl open milk bowl where you keep your milk when you keep it open uncovered outside on the table cat comes slowly and drinks the milk has it happened with you and if you observe when cat is drinking milk it closes the eyes she feels like if i am not seeing anyone no one will see me too so this is the mentality of cat and just very swiftly she laps up the milk so this these are the incidents which i have seen with my eyes so yes though these kind of things happens but no major disaster she creates so she is very cute to keep it at our place so cat sleep anywhere this was the poem i hope you enjoyed the incident i shared the reciting recitation of the poem and i hope that you now will remember what are the lines and what was the explanation now is the time to solve few objective from the worksheet for the same poem 
Please hold the pencil and write the answer in the rough book. Just the answer. So, this is the worksheet and these are the questions. Please give the heading in the rough book. Question 1 MCQ. Yes, question 1 MCQ. I hope boys and girls you are writing it down in the rough book. You will have to just write the answer. I will again send the worksheet. If you have deleted it from the WhatsApp group, nothing to worry about. So let's start solving it. Number one, according to the poet, where does cats like to sleep? Options are somewhere, anywhere, nowhere, elsewhere. See, many of you pronounce this as now where. No, it is nowhere. Options are here. Try to solve it. Your time starts now. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and 0. Did you get the answer? What is the answer for number 1? Cat sleep anywhere. Obviously, anywhere is going to be the answer. Po the cats like to sleep anywhere. Number 2. What is a piano? Yes, just now I explained you what is it. Options are a cat B, a pin cushion, a musical instrument, a thick pipe. So we saw the picture of the piano, we saw the cat sleeping on the piano. What was it? I told you when I showed you the picture. Think about it. Try to recall what did you understand. Your time starts now. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 and 0. Okay, so a piano is musical instrument. I hope that you have marked the same answer. I mean to say you have written the same answer. If not, please write it down. You might have seen piano. Again, you can watch this lecture to understand the things which you might have skipped. Number three, whose lap does the cat like to sleep on in the poem? cats sleep anywhere grandmas grandpas nobody's anybody's so in the poem on whose lap cats like to sleep is described see think three times before you write this answer because 90 percent of you will write the incorrect answer i know why i will tell you afterwards your time starts now five Four, three, two, one, and zero. Okay, what have you written? Grandma? Grandma is the answer. Option A, no. Then it is incorrect. The correct answer is anybody's. Because it was clearly written, let me show it to you, that anybody's lap will do. Clearly here it is written anybody's lap. Yes, in the picture she is sitting on the grandma's lap. But in the poem lines it is mentioned that anybody's lap will do. Yes, many students even in the previous year your seniors have made the mistakes in this answer that is why i was clarifying you with the poem line now you know that these are the lines and now you might have understood why we recited the poem twice because to understand and remember the poem lines is very very necessary okay let us continue number four what is in the cupboard in the poem Cats sleep anywhere. Now you know that cats even sleep in the cupboard, right? So there was a line related to the cupboard. 
again see it was very important to recite the poem right so you might have observed the lines so what is there inside the cupboard frocks socks boxes or shoes out of these four things what is mentioned that was inside the cupboard yes so try to recall your time starts now 5 Four, three, two, one, and zero. Okay. So, what answer have you written? Frogs. Yes. Boys might be debating that, sir. Why should we write frogs in our cupboard? We keep our clothes for the boys. but in the poem it was clearly mentioned that in the cupboard on the on the frocks so frocks is mentioned and inside the cupboard really in the picture frocks are shown let me show it to you again so you can see here in the picture clearly frocks are there and very well it was written that in the cupboard with your frocks okay so i hope that you enjoyed this poem a lot more in the revision part and i hope that you will watch the revision lectures again and again so like i said a lecture in a day a 30 minutes lecture in the day keeps the tension away of exams so i hope that you will keep your tension away you will watch the lectures regularly so that you don't have to worry at the end moment so with this i end my today's lecture and boys and girls please make sure you have to watch the lectures in the proper sequence and also keep sending the homework whenever we are solving anything please make sure immediately after the lecture ends send it to your follow up teacher and that's it then then you have to wait for the next day homework so it is very easy task right so i hope you will follow this have a nice day goodbye